Vanek just filed for a Solana ETF, shooting Solana's price up by 10%. But while everyone's rushing to buy Solana for a potential 5 to 10x, they're missing out on a much bigger opportunity. There's a whole ecosystem within Solana that's primed for massive gains. Imagine finding that next big crypto opportunity while everyone else is distracted with Solana. So the question is, which Solana altcoins should you be buying right now to capitalize on this unique opportunity? Ignoring this can mean missing out on the big biggest potential crypto gains of your life. Think of it like those pictures of icebergs that you always see on the internet. Solana is just a tip, which is what everyone sees. But below the surface lies the life-changing potential gains this bull run. So first, let's talk about the news. Vanek, who has a Bitcoin ETF with about 611 million in assets under management, plus an Ethereum ETF on the way, has filed for the first Solana ETF in the US. Now, while recording this, ARK21 shares is officially the second company to file for a Solana ETF. Now, some may ask, why Solana? Solana. Well, according to Matthew Siegel, the head of digital assets research at Vanek, the native token Sol functions similarly to other digital commodities such as Bitcoin and Ethereum. It is utilized to pay for transaction fees and computational services on the blockchain. Now, you might be wondering, how do ETFs affect crypto prices? Well, ETFs basically make it easier for both institutions and regular people to invest in the crypto assets without actually buying crypto. Now, personally, I'm waiting for BlackRock to file for a Solana ETF so that at that point, then I really know it's official because, well, BlackRock just gets things done. If you look back at when BlackRock first filed their Bitcoin ETF, Bitcoin went up over 95% between the time the ETF was filed to the day of approval. Now, one thing to keep in mind is that this process took about seven months. We can see a similar pattern with Ethereum. BlackRock filed for the Ethereum ETF in November of 2023, and it was approved six months later in May. During that time, Ethereum gained over 100%. So based on this, I'm really waiting for BlackRock to file for their Solana ETF to really know that there's a chance at approval and I'm not going to be expecting an approval for another six months after that but as we've seen with both Bitcoin and Ethereum after the filing the price is going to appreciate in value leading up to that approval so leading up to that approval sure Solana could probably double in that time but where the riches are really going to be is going to be in Solana's ecosystem that my friends is where the real opportunity lies so let's go ahead and get into these altcoins on the Solana network I'm going to be highlighting some of the most promising projects with a ton of upside beginning with the highest market cap and then working our way down to the riskier bets with lower market cap but more upside so first off we're starting with the Pyth network the Pyth network is the largest and fastest growing first party oracle network it delivers real-time market data to financial dApps across 40 plus blockchains and provides 380 plus low latency price feeds across cryptocurrencies equities etfs forex pairs and commodities the Pyth network is currently the 75th biggest crypto buy market cap at 1.5 one billion dollars and it's currently down about 71 percent from its recent all-time high that it set just a few months ago in march if it were just to get back to its recent all-time high that's already a 2.5 x return on your money and with an etf approval you can bet that this would go way higher than just that 2.5 x next we have jupiter currently sitting at just over a billion dollars in market cap currently only sitting at 80 cents as of this recording jupiter is the main liquidity provider on the solana network it's a decentralized exchange aggregator through which 70% of Solana's volume passes. So if we're expecting a lot more money to come into the Solana ecosystem, then you better bet that a lot of that money is going to go through Jupiter. Jupiter is currently down 56% from its recent all-time highs back in April. A move back to its all-time highs from here, we're talking about an easy double of your capital, 129%. Next up, we have Radium, sitting at $1.61 and a $424 million market cap. Radium is an automated liquidity provider built on the Solana blockchain. If you've spent any time trading meme coins, then you're probably familiar with it. It allows liquidity provision for thousands of tokens. Radium's currently down about 50% from its recent highs back in March. A move back up is basically a guarantee to double your money. So those first three plays are pretty much on the safer side of things. For the last two, we're going to really dig deep for projects under a $100 million market cap. So these are probably going to be slightly more risky, but they have way more upside. So from Radium, that's at 420 24 million let's drop below a hundred million dollars all right so here we're under a hundred million 
let's see we're going to look at 34 million that seems like a good number let's see what project this is it is called neon this bad boy is sitting at 60 cents barely even cracking into the top 1000 cryptos by market cap this project unites the ethereum and solana ecosystems allowing developers to deploy dApps on the solana blockchain using ethereum's virtual machine neon is currently down 74 percent from its recent all-time highs back in december when it first came out I mean, it's basically back exactly where it started. I think this is potentially the perfect place to buy. A move back to its previous all-time high, you're pretty much 3Xing your capital. And the thing with these low market cap coins, that could literally happen within hours. And for the last one, we're gonna dip even lower under $30 million market cap, right down here at the end of this list, basically, sitting at $28.5 million. It is called Parcel, currently sitting at 23 cents. It's actually pretty crazy. You can speculate on the real estate market. And it has Coinbase as one of its investors, which is always a good sign. So Parcel is a decentralized exchange for trading real estate. It offers city indexes such as New York, San Francisco, and London for traders to speculate and hedge global real estate. You can see the markets that are trending up. You can see the ones that are trending down. You could literally buy and sell depending what you think the real estate market for these places are gonna do. Remember, real world assets is one of the best performing sectors in crypto so far this year with BlackRock investing over a hundred million dollars into it. So this project plays right into that bucket, which is why I think is a good and promising bet. This is currently down about 67% from its all time highs. And as you guys can see, this literally just launched back in April. So we are super early here and a move back just to its previous all time high you're already tripling your money, 207% return. If this project just goes to $100 million market cap, we're talking about tripling your money. So yeah, this is pretty crazy. I really like this project. Amazing utility, amazing idea, and it has the narrative. So I think it's in the perfect position to explode. Now, for those of you that have stuck around to the end of the video, I have two bonus plays for you. As we know, meme coins have been one of the biggest sectors in crypto so far this year, especially in the Solana ecosystem. So it wouldn't be right to make this video on the Solana ecosystem without also talking about at least a couple of meme coins remember guys meme coins are extremely extremely high risk so be very careful because they could definitely dump on you and you could lose all your money so i'm not going to really cover the top meme coins on here you know we have dog with hat we have bong even book of meme and popcat although all of these can potentially give you a 10 20 or more x return we're gonna dig a little deeper than that because you probably already know about those meme coins and they're all already pretty big so the first meme coin we're gonna look at sits at 122 million dollars currently it is called mitchy currently sitting at 21 cents and you can see in the last seven days it's up already Already over 129%. Mitchie's currently down 65% from its recent all time highs in May. And a move back up just to this recent all time high would be 185% return. You can see on Tweet Scout, it has a pretty good score. It's social graph trending to the upside and has a ton of influencers. And the cool thing about this one is that it's not just about memes, they're working on building utility and an ecosystem within it from NFTs to gaming elements. With it sitting just over 100 million, it still has a lot of upside potential. Potential. The final meme coin I want to talk about is WEN, which is sitting under 100 million market cap, currently at 92.7 million. Now, the interesting thing about WEN is that it wasn't created by some random devs in a basement. It's the brainchild of the team behind Jupiter Exchange. If you've been paying attention, you'll remember that Jupiter was one of the altcoins that we recommended earlier. And it's one of the biggest exchanges on the Solana network. All those hours of work and expertise was put together to create this cute little cat. Oh, look, it shakes. WEN is currently down. 74% from its recent highs back in March. Just to move back up to those levels, we're talking about 284% return. And if you're wondering why should you even care about a silly old meme coin, let me tell you, sometimes in crypto, the silliest things make the biggest gains. Now remember, nothing in crypto is guaranteed except volatility. If you're looking for some high risk, high rewards, then these meme coins might just be what you're looking for. Now to buy these coins, you'll be able to buy some of the bigger ones on centralized exchanges but for the smaller ones you're gonna have to actually use some of these projects we spoke about you can either use jupiter or radium and i'm sure you'll be able to find all these projects that we spoke about today on those exchanges i mentioned earlier that meme coins have been the best performing sector so far this year but you need to know exactly what to look for so that you avoid the 99 percent of meme coins that will eventually go to zero that's why i created an easy to follow checklist of what to look for when searching for that next 1000x meme coin i broke 
down my entire checklist in this video so that you too can use it to find your next life-changing meme coin. Just click on the video on the screen and I'll see you guys there.